All right, I'm back. It is time to finish this zone. If it is short, this is going to be more of the same episode. I don't actually remember which uh, which stairs were new. Living Clone Library? I don't think we've been here. I think this might be the one that, that I wanted to go to. Eternalized Doppelganger Experimentee. Original Skull of a Skeleton. Uh, marvelous Bone made of keratin plates. Just gotta check my audio. Yeah, yeah. Make sure I'm speaking directly into the microphone and uh, I'm close to it. Skull of a second batch doppelganger. Skull of a third batch doppelganger. Death Row. Whales avoid singing when under extreme conditions, something the scientists still haven't managed to circumvent. Oh! Oh! So, uh, they grow their gods in vats, it looks like. Whales were the first beings who learned how to sing. Second batch doppelganger subjected to reverse modules. Several connectors keep the whale's heartbeats synced for eternity. They cannot live separately. Twin whales made in the image of each other. Together, their DNA is being linked to test for doppelganger DNA creation. So the whales... Boy, we already knew that the Song of the Whale produced the energy that people use, and also the spark to create doppelgangers, I think. The cycle of life, baby! Extraction business sells off excess blubber to other parts of the tube for skin replacement treatments. Whale blubber can be extracted extensively from these lab-fed twins. So that's what the plastic surgery is. Whale altered cyborg skull, now with baleen articulations. G the gelatinous goo expelled from mass-produced whalebone skulls smells like garlic. Does it? Humanitarian vegetation. Yeah, if, if, if vegetarians eat only vegetables, what do humanitarians eat? <gasps> it's a box. It's a demon box. Path of the Whales by Iapetus Anno 276. Materials 100% organic whale carcass. Blubber glue. Mineralization by guest artist Janus. Janus. The sculpture represents when whales entered the tube for the first time. A malfunction in the drilling process resulted in sea creatures being pulled into the tube en, ma en masse. So the whales lived in Saturn? That's another door. We came up there, those stairs earlier, didn't we? That is... Guys, I'm in a fever dream. Like, <laughs> what is this game? Uh, this is Danger Wall, right? Yeah. How's my health? Very bad. A quadratic twinning system to force whales into twinhood. Twin whales sing in alternate tones. What do you mean alternate tones? What's an alternate tone? Is that an actual thing? Specimens are subjected to thin therapy and rostrum magnetization. A four-way method of mind merging previously singing whales into subordination. The Whale Twin Quartet can be tuned to sing music that resonates across the entirety of the tube. Almighty Mother Whale, matriarch of all specimens, this one grew in the oceans themselves, only to be captured for the progenity potential. So this is the one they worship. Oh, it's a statue. Okay, so we didn't actually see the statue. I mean, we didn't actually see the whale, we just see the statue again. Whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop. 
All right, time to find where those exact stairs are. They're probably in a similar relative position here. Why are TV excuses manifesting themselves like that? Rocket, give me status data on that bot's allegiance. Beep, running an Ellison scan. Return positive for infestation. Suggestion, initiate antibody procedure. Get in place. Bird, let's go. Just one, please. What did it just do? Okay, there's, there's more. Well, shall we? Haha. <laughs> I like that sound effect. It's like... It's like uh, two marbles clacking together twice. Nope. I did not see that. Early. Okay. Well, I guess I gotta move off that spot. Wish I had counterattack set up. Okay, the static electricity moves spots. Okay, now it's gone. Nice. Uh, I have something that can hit around now, don't I? Yeah. Alright, see how it is. Oh! Forgot about that. Oh, I can move. Let's get off the dynamite spot. Oh, it turned the things into eyeballs. Probably didn't need to use all of it. Um... It got a bunch of health back. I don't like that. Can the bomb explode already, please? It, it doesn't want to. Doesn't want to lose. Hmm. Guess I gotta get the other things first, don't I? Dynamite was good. Oh, holy moly. Yay. Kind of guessed at that. Man, do you have what? One frame for that? Get one of the guys out. Did I get another turn? No. Yeah. Huh. Let's do it again. Bye bye. We got ourselves some of these TV excuses back at the scrapyard. No one knew where they came from. The programming back end is pretty open, so we got them to work for us hackers. All robots have good manners. Yeah, yeah, keep believing, machine. Make a save after that. We've been down here, I'm sure. Where'd the oil come from? Yeah, so it'd be this set of stairs. Living clone library. Here we go again with this endless hacking. The dealer must try harder. I don't remember which buttons B. wasn't enough. Let Rocket try! Oh yeah! Uh.
forgot, you can use the right stick to aim. They shoot? Seems not. Ow. Oh yeah. I aimed for two at once. Full health, here we go. Like they give you the notes to start. Oops. No, no, no. No, no, no. Okay. I didn't pay attention. That you start the, the phase in the right place. They want me to start in this spot. my combo ow all right it's gone yay looks like that was not the end Like I just, yeah, no need to hit him. This guy shoot? No. He's got an easy, ow. <laughs> Dang it, right when I was talking. It's boss time. Watch out, my health is low. Almost gone. Yeah. We're still going? All right, we got difficulty up this time. Watch out for our health. Not bad. Oh, oh, bad. Okay. You have full health, I guess, is plus points then. Ran into him. Boss is gone. Yay. Not bad. Immortal cell. HP up. The music box of Saturn 17 and uh, 18 and 19. It's a music box. One of those Bobo was chasing. How do you open it? Rocket can't do it on this one. Why not? Something inside is blocking it. Can't access. I thought that's what we, I guess that's not what we just did. That's weird. Why is it not responding the same way as the others? Maybe. Maybe if we- Ah! Hall of Engineering? 
attempting to locate self. Location identification failed. Inadequate state. Rocket lost again. All right. Engineering neural T, best on the market. Let's hit the save. All right, looks like we are in a totally new zone, so this must be a new video. This cart is engineering sound on a parallel sound wave that is tuned down to 5% volume, but adds layers and body to the sound of life. Nice. My signals detect environmental changes. Pleasant changes. Engineering neural T, engineering patience into your anxious brain. This cart ignites electricity for this electrical pole, a poor use of resources. Digging the music here. Those who failed the merge were ensnared within the music box. Oh, we're inside the music box. Skull of a failed satellite. What is this enigmatic device? Is that a jukebox? The undead are taking over the dream state. An aberration of both science and theology. What is this? Who is that? Is that the gin? I can't walk that way, it seems. Or examine. Devices work in conjunction to harvest whale blubber and other skin deep resources. And this music sounds like something's about to go down. Oh hey. This tube injects preservation preservatives to keep this whale eternally alive and siphon her song for electrical production. Oh no, cannot leave Brother Dealer be here harmed and alone. Have a milkshake in the butt. Oh, uh, what happened? Brother Dealer has fallen unconscious. I saved him. Thank you, I guess. Without me, Brother Dealer would have died forever. That's what you think, bot. But sometimes you're not so bad, you know. Rocket, very useful. No need to abandon it. The teleportation must have shocked Brother Dealer dead. I don't really mind now. We should go find Bobo. Together? Together. Let's go. Uh... That was plot important. What now? I mean, I don't see Bobo anywhere. He's not here, right? Can I can I go somewhere? Does dealer need to hack something? That's leg legacy technology meant to keep EP locked. Such simple hacking this is. I wonder what it does. All right, well, we're gonna meet somebody. These are some pretty tall pillars. They seem inactive. Should Rocket wake them up? Let's do it. Ah! I love it. this robot just slapped me. How dare you slap my precious deafness. Your beautiful face. Has he caused you any harm? Oh no, my love. I'm eternally intact. That robot is harmless against my marble-like body. 
Next time, be more careful, robot. Daphnis may look sturdy, but his skin is sensitive. I am very sorry. It seemed you were in deep slumber. That's because we were. What is it you're doing here? Interrupting our lovers' quarrels? Well, I'm looking for my sister. She's called Bobo. Bobo. That name doesn't ring any bells for me. Me neither. Who are you guys anyway? I am the Asura Pan, and I am the Deva Daphnis. I think I mixed up their voices. We are respectively Saturn 18 and Saturn 19, sons of Lord Saturn. Punished by our own father to live a life locked inside a music box because of our sin. The sin of love between an Asura and a Deva is of great consequence to our people. What? Good news, bad news, ironic news, you are not the only ones. Tethys and Mimas were also punished for that, but they weren't locked in a music box. Why were you? Besides our affair, Daphnis has also written the last melody, which is now prohibited. With all melodies, one has the power of activating Saturn's clock. At the time, Pan thought of using it against Saturn to protect our love. Allowing time to flow naturally would make satellites age, and Saturn himself might perish. Pan's job and Daphne's job are vital for the longevity of the Saturnian society. How does that work? The whole melody thing? Well, it seems you're very curious. And you both feel like sharing? That is true, actually, isn't it? It's been a long time since someone last came to visit us. I feel... excited. Last time was probably our little sister. Sadistic little Pandora. Ah, uh, she mentioned your Bobo. Apparently Bobo has been playing her game. Bobo is playing Pandora's game? While I'm here working like crazy to find her? Oh no, don't feel betrayed, boy. Your frowning makes you look less charming. The melodies are part of a decoding system. It opens up the Book of Law's History Registration Program. The Keylocker Program. With the Keylocker Program, one can rewrite history. The responsibility is too great. Only a few VIPs have access to it. Such as Hyperion, Pandora, Prometheus, the Prince, and Titan himself. But if someone manages to gather all melodies, would they be able to open the Keylocker program? Not quite. They would still need one of the original ID holders. Are you making plans, doppelganger? He is, isn't he? I assume you wouldn't give us that melody you hold without a fight then? Absolutely not. It's time to obliterate this doppelganger, Pan. Exciting. I will protect you, Daphnis. That is a weird sprite. Are they gonna split an orbital resonance later? Two minds, one soul. Okay. Does that mean I cannot gain EP? I, w I wonder. Well, let's get close and attack. Let's try this. Does it not work? It works fine. I don't know what that status effect does. I mean, here's the thing. They tell me the status effect in the tutorial, but they don't show me what sy symbol it is. So I read it and then I forget it. And I don't know how to how to uh, um, match it with the symbols I see in battle. They have almost no EP, so here we go. I did almost nothing. Wow, that's a lot of HP. Ah. Yay! Looks like there's a big window for dodging that. 
All right, let's heal up. Nom, 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 nom. And this seems to have done nothing last time. So let's walk here. And let's give you a big punch. Yeah. Oh, did basically nothing. Too early. So I'm gonna. You're gonna counterattack me, right? Yeah. You know. You know. It's fine. Banker. Banker does like nothing, right? I don't know. Let's put the counter up. Dang it. Dang it. Late. But I get to counter. No? What? Why can't I counter? Uh, no, no, no. 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 Uh, can I not use an item? I press this way and then I move this. Uh, I guess I can't use an item this turn. I guess it's bugged. Early. Okay, now let's use an item. Amount zero. That's why I can't use it. Okay, that's bad. Get some EP and then some armor. Early. This is not good. Okay, do I have more oil? When did I run out of milkshakes? Okay, let's do a big hammer. Oh, this isn't a hammer. Let's see if this hits him hard. Not really. Okay, let's put on the defense. It says it counters, but it didn't counter last time. Ah! So maybe I have to... There we go. Maybe I have to perfect dodge for it to counter the counter. Punch time. I could also stand to use an oil. There we go. Oh man, why are you over there? I don't like I don't like that you're over there. I'm gonna add some more armor. There we go. There's the counterattack. Oh, no phase two? Just smash? <laughs> ah, it seems we have lost Daphnis. Indeed, my love. But it was fun, wasn't it? To tell you the truth, there are many reasons for us to resent the satellites and let you have this melody. We have been locked and punished, sent here as our exile. But they wouldn't leave us alone, experimenting on us. The satellite legislation doesn't protect us anymore. We've been served as guinea pigs to the scientists of the doppelganger breeding grounds. Altered and morphed together for their own gains. Since we're genetically altered, the satellites see us like they see you. Something imperfect to be used and to serve them. Although that is our reality, we are moon shepherds. And that's all we have ever been. We are still part of the ring system that protects and locks Saturn. 
we protect the Saturnian ring integrity. Any wandering debris, we are there to bring it back to its place. None of the satellites really want time to continue to flow. They want to preserve their future. Well, you can die right now then. And don't forget to give me that melody of yours. There's no need for that. You have won in combat honorably. You shall have the melody. This shall be our time to leave. It was good meeting you, Doppelganger. We hope to see you again at the end of all this. Yeah, so that's another thing about moons of Saturn in particular, but also Jupiter too, I think, is that some of them that are within the rings or close to the rings help keep the rings in a ring shape because of their gravity. A, a thing I heard in probably high school. Hello. You aren't going to fight me now, are you? I'm going to hop down here and get some, some of this. Dangerous, don't go up. Come on, go up. Cyber Decoder XP, best operational system for cyber decoding ever created. Is there a ladder? Uh, there is a ladder. Behind this stuff. Dead Warmonger's Skull. Sterling Silver. Data encoder, so that governmental agencies cannot trace back the horrors being done here. Hand over the bot. A deal's a deal. You can have him. Go, Rocket. Go with Hyperion. She knows where Bobo is. Okay, Rocket is going to find owner. Uh, gotta love an anti-hero. I guess I have to be the bad guy so that Bobo, Ivy, and I can live a peaceful life. It's for the best. Yeah, so our characters, yeah, they, they, they kind of want to do uh, what's right, kind of, but they also kind of want to be selfish and do what's good for them and uh, screw whatever happens to everybody else. And so they're, they're, they're not heroes, they're not, not really anti-heroes, although sometimes they're anti-heroes. They're, they're just kind of gray characters, and I like that. Infinity Staircase, what happens if I don't move? Okay. Well, it's it's infinitely long, so I gotta go up backwards. Yep, tired. It, no, you get up. Here's how you get up. You you go backwards and then you, you BLJ. You'll be less tired if you jump. My HP is down pretty... Right, I didn't recover. I'm going slower now. Oh, I like this music. Amagist? Yeah, there's nothing over here. It's not really in the mood. Whoa! What is this imagery? Atlas! The bearer of the world. Oh, man. This song, this, this imagery, this... Wow! just had to listen to it for a little while. This is not a moment to rush through. You have my doppelganger being kept as a prisoner. Your eyes deceive you about the truth of my actions, innocent child. 
Your sister insisted she wished to go to the Eternal Dome at all costs. And there she will cry her last words. A doppelganger who can sing. She is rare and deserves a better future than that, and so do you. I kinda wish I could get this Xbox to go away to just see the place and the vibe. Unlike your sister, however, you are wiser. Heed my advice. Search for a place to live far from the satellite's vigilance. That was my wish, but now I want more. Shouldn't you be helping them? The satellites? I'm not one of them. I've abandoned my duty to the satellite system. Now I protect the doppelgangers. And those who live under the tyrannical satellite ruler, Titan. I have no intention of harming you. For many, many years I have been bound to the dome, holding its weight and protecting the lower zones. I'm just soaking this in. This is not only... Not only is this a vibe, this is good writing, too. Oh my god! Strongest moment in the game. Oh! Guys. Are you feeling the same? I am... I am communing with the divine right now are you, are you feeling it <laughs> oh. for many years i have been bound to the dome holding its weight and protecting the lower zones were i not here the dome's weight would be too great and it would crush every single zone below it i have been protecting your world the world of doppelgangers for as long as i can remember Titan thought he was passing me a burden, the burden of the world, but I agreed willingly. My sentence to be tied to the weight of the world is my duty, and it will always be my pleasure to protect those who have no power to protect themselves. If I can protect that which the satellites created with my own body, then I will. The satellites seem to have forgotten their duties as the creators of all in this world, haven't they? You are correct, so forget ideas of trying to make them understand the world you want to create. They believe they have achieved immortality. Titan can see through the past, present, and future. Nothing can harm him anymore. That's different information to what I got from Pan and Daphnis. That's all I know. And we satellites can be unreliable narrators. In a world this disheveled, you, however, my innocent child, will go back from where you came, wherever it may be. Where I was? The place I once called home was destroyed by Titan. I still remember his words. Please don't repeat the entire speech. <laughs> All citizens of the Scrapyard Zone, my heart aches for you, but it is time to detach your zone from the tube. The structure of your zone will be ignited in three hours. This means, of course, the imminent deaths of all Scrapyard Zone civilians. In these three hours, say your goodbyes to your loved ones. You will always be remembered. After ignition, your zone will explode and generate enough energy to propel the tube upwards. Attempting to escape your judgment will not be possible. All exits have already been sealed. Do not panic. Your sacrifice will give way to one of the biggest steps into our civilization's future. Yep, dealer remembers every last word of this speech. He said that as he burned our home to the ground with a smile. We have nowhere to go. Bobo is my only family. Well, she and my girlfriend. 
There's nothing more to pursue for us but to try to find somewhere we can be safe. Nowhere inside this government is safe. What is your plan then, my child? I want to leave Saturn. I want to live in the dome and be accepted by them. Frick that! We're leaving Saturn! To leave Saturn? That will be complicated. I wonder if that was an ending deciding choice. The pioneers were constructing a spaceship that used the tube as a turbine to propel itself upwards. After detaching every single zone below the Eternal Dome, carrying the whole of the Eternal Dome until its next destination, the satellite's next colony, Nibiru. In the Eternal Dome, they tried to mimic organisms from across the dome zones. There you can find molecular hydrogen, artificial trees, hanging gardens with climbing vines. All they could put together in the smallest space they could to fit the spaceship complex. Of course, a spaceship can't be too big, otherwise it wouldn't fly. Or that's what Titan said to us. Many doubted that. Many thought that we could bring all zones together with us. But Titan never cared to preserve history. Our history. You would get rid of anything, old or malfunctional, in no time. Your sister was a surprise, I'd imagine, even for Titan. A bug that couldn't be crushed. For someone like Titan, she's his worst nightmare. For someone like Pandora, however, she's an interesting specimen to play with. If Pandora faces either a bug or a fascinating specimen, the result will be fatal all the same. If you wish to free your sister from the system I've created to protect her, you'll have to hack her from the inside out. Gut her out of the system with your bare hands. You mean to disconnect a doppelganger from the Keybase network? But what could be the consequences of that? Wouldn't she die? You would know more than me. Aren't you working with the creators of the system? Yes, but... If I can tell you one thing about the future, it is this. Janice saw more of your sister than simply stopping at the doppelganger breeding ground. I tried to impede her march forward out of worry as it pains me to see you suffer. But this prison made by me in the doppelganger breeding grounds won't be her end. I've never done such surgery before. I... There's always a first, my innocent child. You have all it takes to free your sister, although I can't attest to your ability of thriving in the land of lions. Now go, free her. Obo. I'm sorry for doing this. I know you're hurting. It was never my intention to hurt you. You're my sister. Look at this. But this is the only way f out for us. You must be disconnected from the Keybase network to be freed from Atlas's prison. I don't know why you tried to fight her by yourself, but she's on our side. And so am I. You know that, right? I'll always be on your side. I know that in the future, you might discover truths you didn't really want to know. About me and Rocket. I've done bad things, but it was all from a place of goodwill. I was trying to save you, to save us both. You and Ivy are my only family, and you will thank me later. As long as you try to understand me, all will be alright. Who are you? Why are you here? Huh. I see. So this is your database hall. All of your memories in one place. Should I peek into one of these doors? No! You can't look into a girl's secret diary! What memory are you? Childhood? Makes sense since you don't recognize me. I thought, however, you'd be able to identify me even if I look older. Can't you recognize your brother, Bobo? 
My big brother is Coco. You're not Coco. You're much taller. Coco is smaller than me. That's absolutely not true. I was always taller than you. Bobo, I'm sorry for invading your memories. I can feel you're nearby. Can you call her, little Bobo? Call who? You from the future. What for? She's so lame. She keeps talking about boring things. Like what? Like how we should fight people. I don't want to fight anyone. I want to play with Coco. The, the walk, the animation. Easier times, huh? I too wish I could just play with you all day. All right. Dealer, it was pretty uncouth of you back there. Kind of a violent way of getting me out of the system. Couldn't you have just hacked me? You didn't work the same as other doppelgangers, do you? You're a bug. Even you're calling me that now? When are you taking me out of here? Should we go now? Or do you want to reminisce the older, simpler times? For me, there's only the future. Time to go then. Thank you, Atlas. You're welcome, my innocent child. Take her to safety. I hope you'll be safe. What about you? Me? I will continue to hold the weight of the world until I die. Can't you come with us? And risk the lives of all those living under me? That is a steep price to pay for my freedom. I don't wish for any of that. I just hope for our creations, for the doppelgangers, and all creations of the Saturnian tube to live happily. I'll come back and save you. Don't bother with me, my child. I have faith in you. Now go. I'm much too weak these days. I feel as if my days are numbered. I think this is a really interesting rendition of Atlas. Atlas. Go! Upper elevator! Guys, we made it. We're making it to the Eternal Dome. So, what's up with you and the Prince? You disappeared and I had to babysit your bot. Rocket? You found Rocket? Yeah, when you should be the one finding him. What happened there? Where's Rocket though? He was captured. Captured? Again? Calm down. I've already passed the info to the Keybase Network, guys. They're onto it. I couldn't do anything. It was Hyperion. She just picked him up and left. Wow, this is good writing. Oh my goodness. The tension, the irony. Oh, I love characters keeping secrets from each other with good reason. Oh, I love it. It makes the music, it makes all the vibes, it feels powerful. Wow, this part of the game is strong. Oh, this game had some ups and downs. This is an up part. This is up for sure. I went after them and they were nowhere to be seen. Ah, uh, Rocket. Do you think they're going to deactivate him? I don't think so. There's something about this bot that we just don't know yet. I wonder if we're going to have to fight each other at the end. I don't know, probably not, but you know, I just wonder. But they're probably just experimenting on him. Do you think they will rig his memories? What if he doesn't remember us anymore? It's just a machine. It doesn't have memories. That's... You're a hacker person. You should know better than that. This is the nature of a world controlled by data. What about the prince, though? The prince betrayed me. 
but it was against his will. Hyperion has some way of controlling him. He took me to Hyperion and I barely made it out alive. Yeah. Bobo and the prince. Uh, Bobo thinks the prince is their ally. Dealer thinks Hyperion is, the, is his ally. They think each other are their ally. But the prince and Hyperion are enemies. How is this going to play out? Wow. Oh, man. The vibe they have going here, this, this synchrony between the art, the music, and the story, the characters. It's so good! How did you get out? I kicked the prince in the gut. You kicked him? Why am I surprised, even? Well, I, I tried not to be too harsh. He seems to be controlled by the system and his superiors. He likes me, you know. I bet he does. Especially after you kicked him. Look, I had to get out of there. Anyways, I tried to find you, but the path led me to a door that opened to Atlas. A door? You didn't climb a glass staircase? No, not really. That's... I had to go up some glass stairs to get to Atlas. I almost died. Y you what? That's... I didn't know you went through all of that. Don't mind me, Bobo. All this is for one goal. Our cause. We're getting closer. Get ready. Chapter 7, Dead Air, The Eternal Dome, Titan's Hanging Gardens level. Golden Gates of the Dome, we're gonna save that and we're gonna call it for today. Oops, nope, we're gonna watch this little cutscene. Gods, let them be. She is one of Pandora's toys. I'm gonna see what... I'm curious to see who and what Pandora is. What she is doing, what her powers are, you know. It's like she's, um... Does she, like, implant memories and drive into Bobo to make her this way so that Bobo would choose to come up here? And it's gonna be like a... Oh, how do I say this? Like, um, uh, like manipulating Bobo's free will, basically. Uh, I, sh I shouldn't use the, I shouldn't talk too much about free will these days. It's a weird, weirdly contentious topic on the internet. Um, <laughs> um, but basically. Welcome to the Eternal Dome 8080 and 8181. <laughs> This is the last level of Pandora's game. She would proudly show you around, but it's tea time. Please be comfortable as if it is your house and enjoy your journey. And we will go into this next time. Again, I don't know if this was one or two episodes, but it is what it is. Wow, did, guys, did that last scene that rise before the elevator with Atlas, that hit you as hard as it did me. That was, wow. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you thought in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more Key Locker and other awesome games. I'll see you next time. Bye.